So we've always kind of built our own recipe, which is why I think we're one of the few places that use like the local oils as much as possible. Because most people can just Google a recipe and then they're like, okay, well I want a hundred of those bars. So they'll just do it times 10 or something. But we've kind of worked it from the other way, like sourcing these local oils and seeing it and applying it to like what we want it to do in the end. So I think we almost took like mm -hmm. an opposite approach. Again, it's really rewarding because you just have these really vibrant colors and then you have these really extreme smells. And then that reaction, when, when the oils hit the lye, there's something that happens that's just like kind of mesmerizing. And I think that's like what we really kind of started doing this for is that you we kinda like, yeah, you just kinda watch it. It's hypnotizing Yeah, to see something turn into something else so fast. It was like, because we had been experimenting with it for a while. Yeah, at first it was like, you just know. Just kind of geeking out. Just like a, like, like a hobby, like. Yeah, we'd take fat from different restaurants and we would <clears throat> just kind of read through books. And, you know, really with something like this, you're kind of coming out of nowhere. Like most people don't have a foundation for making soap. And so there's a couple months of just messing around. And we had never sold it. And we went, set up a tent in Benson Days. Yeah, the booth was a nightmare. The booth was a nightmare. <laughs> we, like everything about it, we were just like, we had no idea what we were doing. We like showed up late, running down the street with a table. And anyway, people just bought all of it. Yeah, I mean, like every, everyone's a critic, and like we both have culinary backgrounds, so I think it's something that you're kind of used to. But like like people's like how they feel about whatever it's gonna like affect you a lot you know so it's very important to us but yeah no I think I mean yeah because each I mean each little bar is like an extension of you because you want each one to be like perfect perfect that's where the anxiety comes in because you have people who are using this on their children in their own shower to clean their clothes or to like relax in and so it's, it's actually kind of, it's really beautiful because you, you get all of these people just thanking you for their relaxation or thanking you for how their kids loved this bath bomb. And it's, it's kind of a really unexpected dimension of the whole thing that I've really liked. But yeah, you know, you just kind of, you have to just wake up and learn to have fun with each other again and learn to just laugh off things that happen and uh we're pretty good at that we're pretty good at laughing because <laughs> <laughs> we need it yeah yeah <laughs> but yeah i'm tim maids and this is why i create i'm ryan cook and this is why i create